let us now move on to the next question here the set is a finite set and it is defined between 1 and 6 of course only the whole numbers and relationship is b equal to a plus 1 we need to check for a reflexive symmetric and transitive relationship if r is reflexive a comma a should satisfy the condition b equal to a plus 1 where b can be substituted with a thus a is equal to a plus 1 and this is not possible and hence this is not reflexive similarly symmetric check if r is symmetric then a comma b and b comma a both should satisfy r so b equal to a plus 1 if it is true a equal to b plus 1 should also be true if we substitute a equal to b plus 1 in b equal to a plus 1 then we get 2 equal to 0 which is not possible and hence r is not symmetric so we can illustrate this with considering a subset 2 comma 3 from the given set 3 is equal to 2 plus 1 but 2 is not equal to 3 plus 1 that is this is 2 comma 3 and this is 3 comma 2 and for 3 comma 2 this relationship does not hold good let us do the transitive check if a comma b and b comma c belong to r c comma a should also belong to r for transitive relationship proceeding in the similar manner as we did in uh, symmetric check we can understand that r is not transitive again a simple illustration will give you more meaning considering the sets 1 2 2 3 and 1 3 we can get 2 equal to 1 comma or 1 plus 1 and for 2 comma 3 we can get this 3 equal to 2 plus 1 and the first element and second element here 1 comma 3 3 equal to 1 plus 1 it is not true and hence r is neither reflexive nor symmetric or transitive for that matter so going with the second method of defining subsets and solving this we can write let's say this is a and this is b if a equal to 1 b should be equal to a plus 1 which is 2 for a equal to 2 b should be equal to 3 for a equal to 3 b is 4 for a equal to 4 b is 5 a equal to 5 b is 6 for a equal to 6 b is 7 but there is no 7 here thus possible subsets are 1 comma 2 2 comma 3 3 comma 4 4 comma 5 and 5 comma 6 from these subsets you can observe that you don't have 1 comma 1 or 2 comma 2 or 3 comma 3 to prove reflexiveness also if I have 1 comma 2 I don't have 2 comma 1 here so it is not symmetric also if I have 1 comma 2 here and 2 comma 3 I don't have 1 comma 3 in the subset 